Well, whose idea was the camera? And what are you hoping to, oh, to get out of those? I, I always had a camera. <laughs> I, mean, I, I, I don't think you guys seen, I haven't seen it in season, but I always carry my little, my little, my little <laughs> camera. Um, just, just that. I mean, I mean, I'm really into photography. I love creating. I love, you know, like, um, just beautiful things. And I think when you have a camera, you know, it's just um, documenting, you know, like, kind of like some cute, like cool moments of my life. Like, I, um, I love that. And, and yeah, like, I've, I've always had that. This is just the first time you guys kind of officially see it. But, <laughs> Um, I was like, how long have you had that one in particular? You, you, Probably you a year. It seems like, yeah, it's been like a year or so, or so like that. I mean, I think like now I have a team of like, you know, like our content team and, and right. I think, you know, like once I kind of like lean into that a little bit more, um, you know, I decided to get a camera. Uh, I've always wanted to get one and, mm -hmm. and I like film. So in particular, which is like, you know, really different and, and I can't really see what I'm shooting. You know, <laughs> until like, you know, it, it, it seems like old school. You know, mm -hmm. um, and. I just love like that, just rawness of everything, and, and just you know knowing that I just point and shoot and see what I get. Rick, and I love that part. Of it. Rick mentioned that meeting down in Orlando with a bunch of important people to you. What did that mean to you? What did you guys get done there, and how much yeah. did that help with yeah, getting no, to was, where we are today? Yeah, it was great. I think just them taking the time coming in and um, just just talking with me, and and I think for me it's just like getting to know each other, like you know, like they get to know who I am as a player, as a competitor. Um, you know, what I do, you know, my regular basis and what I do in the summer, how I approach being a professional, like I think all these different things and, and I think some of you just align on so many points. Um, and, and again, like I said, for me, like the goals were there. Um, I, want, I want to always be in a team that aspires to win and, and um, that's why I play the game. Um, and, and for me, it's just like, you know, like we just had everything aligned for us and, and um, such, such a great, great time. Um, and, yeah, I think it definitely made things even smoother than, than they were. How much did Tyrese blow up your phone about this yeah. kind of stuff? <laughs> no, we talk, we talk. Um, obviously, you know, like he texts me and, and we, we talk about, you know, different things. But um, yeah, I'm excited about, you know, just the opportunity to play with him again. Um, and, you know, I think, you know, we didn't really get to, like, really show what we can really do as a duo. I feel like, um, I think there's, there's, like, the more we get to know each other, I think there's going to be even more. Um, he's going to learn more about what I do and what I can do and I'm going to continue to learn about him and and I think just like you know like sometimes like it's just the instinct of just like playing together is going to feel even like better as we go like I think once you like it's easy to just play with someone because they have talent and we can just put talent together and play but I think once you, you get to know each other and like you actually like you know connect on, on a level that's probably going to help you like I like I want to fight for my brother or like I want to fight you know for this person because you know, like we, we actually close. So I think that um, you know those things are gonna come, and, and I'm excited about that. You talked you talked a lot up there about how important it was that everybody just made you feel welcome. I think one thing that Tyrese also made a point of saying was, I'm also trying not to hover over him yeah, all the yeah, time. Yeah. I don't want him to feel like there's pressure. And obviously, it's big for them to make sure they, they kept you on board. Right. I mean, how did they? How did everybody kind of walk that line? Yeah, um, no, I think it was good. I think it was it was perfect. I think we, we we just kept it normal and we had some conversations and. And I think for me, like I said, I'm a, I'm a pretty observing guy, like an observing guy, like I, I, you know, I can see, you know, and, and you know, like I can see, like, how, like if people want you around, like you know. And I think like it's not really much that I'm not like a talking a lot type of person anyway. So, um, but we had our conversations, and I think everyone again has been making it kind of like you know so welcoming for me, and like always want to be like, man, like I, I like I want you to come back, like let's do this again, you know, and and, and um and that part was also great. A contract like this obviously brings expectations. What are your expectations, both for yourself and? Yeah, I want to continue to grow as a player. I want to be the best version of myself. I think you know, there's so many um, more layers to my game that can get improved. And, and for me, I just want to continue to grow as a player, which is something that I've always done. You know, no matter when I was a rookie or you know when I have the contract I have now. Like I, I, don't, I don't think that part of it doesn't really change for me because that's who I am as a player and as a person in general. And then I, think, I think as a team, we just we want aspirations to win. Like we want to win. I think, you know, with my experience, you know, like winning a championship before, uh, I want to be able to bring that culture here and we got to work towards it. It's going to be hard um, and, 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 and it's going to take a lot. And, and I think, you know, we have a team to do it and we're going to go and fight and give everything that we have to, to accomplish that. What are the areas you want to improve in? Uh, for me, I think like I want to, you know, continue to get better on defense. For our team, you know, some of the things that we're doing is different than what I've, I've been used to. I want to, I want to do that. Um, I think for us, we can continue to get better 
um, without just the way we play, connecting together, and then also we, you know, Eastern Conference, all the games we lost, you know, like, uh, like Eastern Conference Finals against Boston, it was like, you know, late game. So we got to continue to get better at that. Um, you know, like I, I just think that I, we, we're close, but we just got to know that it's going to take a lot more for us to even get close back to, to where we were at or even better. So um, I think that's something that we got to continue to think about. You've been on a championship team. Do you see similarities between that team and what's going on here? You know, I think it's like, I think when you want to like win a championship, I think for me, I think it's a, it's a combination of like, you know, obviously having talent, um, people that are, you know, connected, uh, that work hard. And it's also a combination of like experience and, and youth and, 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 and I think all those things together and obviously having a all of him coach like I mean like those are those are recipe for success. What the we wanna delve, delve in a little more on the defense. I mean like where what was the biggest kind of adjustment getting used to how they play and, and, well, and how think, how can you take Yeah, I mean I think it's like again we can get into the details of it, but it's like just little things. Like I mean like I like I, I mean I think for me I just give you a simple example, like uh like when I played in Toronto, it was like, all right. If a pass coming from the wing to the corner, I try to take away the corner pass, right? Like, mm -hmm. we don't want to do that here. You know, I want you want the pass to go to the corner. It's like just little things where it's like instinctively in my head, I'm just gonna do it because my body is like used to that. Right. <laughs> um, but then like it's just not that. You know what I mean? That's just something like super simple that again like you get to learn with a new team, and I have to mm -hmm. adjust to. And um, so I think like just little things like that is a, there's a bunch of other things, but I'm not gonna name all of them. But sure, right. but but yeah. But it's that kind of small detail. Yeah, details and what like you yeah, want out or the of, scheme yeah. of like what we we need to do as a team and right. and again like you know things that for me like I was I was used to doing a certain way and I have to like unlearn it and mm. learn a new way. You right. know, and I think that that takes time. Right. Um, but I'm committed to it.